Hey folks, Species7 here, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to my playthrough of Age of Engineering. Ah, it's a little dude. I hate these little dudes. Whew. <laughs> ah, that's the problem with playing in the woods, even in the broad daylight, it can get a little bit of scary. Alrighty, let's, uh... Let's carry on. <laughs> so yeah, welcome back to Age of Engineering. Now I'm just, uh, I'm finding that, uh, I don't know if it's been upped a little bit or what, but it's really starting to seem like, uh, industrial craft power generation uses way, way excessive amounts of fuel. So... As I prefer not to spend my entire life mining for coal. I know coal mining's an honorable enough profession, but I thought it might behoove me. Are you gonna get any saplings? Come on. To get a tree farm up and running. Because uh, producing charcoal in our blast furnace, and I should probably seriously contemplate building another one of those or not uh, blast furnace or cold coke furnace um seems to be the way to go it's the only thing Ooh, i finally got a sapling look at me go <laughs> see so, yeah, i planted a little tree farm back here just to Make sure that I would have stacks of wood to turn into charcoal. Uh, here we go. We're starting to get a sapling or two. Boink. Nice. Some of these fancy blue trees. Actually found the first one of those in my mining world. Okay, it's getting really dark. Um... I need saplings, and I can't wait. So I'm going to waste a little bit of my hacks on whacking down some saplings. Nice. Eight. That'll do. That will do really well. Uh, there should be one about there. Yeah. Okay. Ah. Uh, I don't mind these guys showing up, I just don't want to get ambushed. Alright, let's go back in the house. Okay, you're just going to be an annoyance. Okay, although actually before I go in the house, the reason I did that was... There we go. To make some more fuel for my continued thirst for power here. Alrighty. And ooh ah, another seven blocks. <laughs> yeah, it's wow. Let me tell you. Whew. Just go through it. Okay, now last time around, we uh, managed to put this puppy together. The blast furnaces. And along with that, the compressor to supply us with the air to make the blast furnace go <sighs> as it does so well. well. I actually need that one. But I'm going to be honest with you. This is just a bit annoying. You hear it's running now? It wasn't a moment ago. And the reason it wasn't is because it wasn't getting the compressed air. Now I have added two more of each. And what I want to do today is a little bit of automation. Um, what we're going to need for that is hoppers. Uh, bubbity bup. Ha, transfer pipes. Transfer nodes. Transfer filters. And a grated hopper. Alright, now hoppers, simple enough, just require a bunch of aluminum and a chest. So. 
we look at Hopper, ta-da, there we go. As I say, some aluminum ingots and a chest. All right, the graded Hopper is the same thing, but you add an iron bar. And what that allows you to do is whitelist an item. It basically makes it a filtered hopper. So we'll need one of those. Now, as for transfer, if we go to that part of the world, here we are. We need transfer nodes, which are those. So let's start there, shall we? To get a transfer pipe, you need hopper ducts, stone slabs, and glass. Hopper ducts are more aluminum with simply planks. Now, here is a thing. If you're wondering, well, stone slabs, oh, I gotta cook up stone, I'm busy making minerals, blah, blah, blah. All right, andesite and granite are also stone, okay? If we go, there we go, take three of these. You'll see they quite handily make slabs. Now, what if you need actual smooth stone and not slabs? Well, one, two, three. So you can, with no energy, no anything else, directly convert andesite or granite into smooth stone. However, I don't think it was actually smooth stone we required. It was the, uh, and I didn't really need to make any, I've got lots. But anyway, for these, and these are very simple as I said, so you go aluminum and poplar and some kind of plank, that'll give you four of those. Once you have four of those, combine them with the six stone, a piece of glass, that'll give you one transfer pipe. Remember when those used to give you a stack of 64? Yeah, not anymore. Once you have a transfer pipe, you're going to have to sacrifice one of them, a hopper, and here's where that stone comes in, and some redstone, and get yourself a transfer node. Oh, and a, a wooden chest uh, is also uh, required. Oh. I'm pretty sure I hear a witch, and I don't like that. Uh, yeah, really close to, apparently. Just to get rid of some of my excess because I will run into lots of it. All right, now you see this is once again shut down, and it's because most of the air it needs was over there. There we go. So let's figure out how to get full cans of air into these and empty ends of cans of air back into there. Shouldn't be tough. First thing we're going to need is this stuff. Now, these little guys, it makes four, but you only need three. So do a little bit of the control, so you're in the sneak or crouch method. There we are, we're going to do that. And then on our compressor, we're going to actually put the node of transfer. For, for, for. <laughs> okay, and then, well, before I do that, we want this set to single item, and you simply right click. There we go. I, I'm not 100% sure it makes a difference, but it was mentioned in what I saw, so we will do as we are instructed. Darn it. Even if we are a man. Okay, now that, believe it or not, is going to allow us <laughs> to take these guys. I'm going to need a whole bunch more of these. And if we put them in here and allow them to fill, they will move them along as needed. Now, just to head start a few things here. Okay, he's got four in them already. Let's make sure. So you'll see it is passing them along to where they're needed. Okay. And it will eventually... Oh. It's actually worked its way all the way out to the last one already. So that's working fine. Okay. 
The only thing we need to do now is get the suckers back. Best way to do that, as far as I know, anyway, is let's get ourselves some uppers. Yes, indeed. And we're going to go, well, we got to and diggy diggy there we go all right hoppers we're gonna want them to go here so crouch and slam a hopper slam a hopper slam a hopper there we are they're all feeding into each other beautiful so at some point ah uh, okay we do have a, tr a bit of an issue of course um okay, I don't actually need to access that. So that's maybe not an issue. But what I do need to do is be able to get in behind here. back down all right and um, okay so have actually um, gone one up from there. Don't know why it went all the way to the bottom. And you're going to go, well, because that's where you put it. And yeah, you probably got a good point. So, let's put it there. Now, come on, dirt. Alright, because I need to come out of the bottom of it. And then get up into there. So, That is our compressor. Hmm. So, watch, now I'm not going to have enough transfer pipe. See, I shouldn't have to. Yeah, I know what the issue is. Um, hmm. Boy, I hate going this far back, but let's do it. Okay, you're fine. And... make things so much easier. So, oops. Okay, now, yeah, don't want to have 
have a wrench in your hand. <laughs> no, indeed. Okay. I hate how it does that, to be honest with you. <laughs> I'm never a fan of that. But it does, doesn't it? Okay, here we go. Electric heaters. One, two, three. And... One, two. One, two. And one, two. Alrighty. Yeah, I don't like those bridges, but the only one we can actually break is that one. There we go. That's a little neater. I do like that much more. Okay, you guys are doing your thing. So, now, yep, furnace, and shift click. Furnace. Shift click. Okay. And another shift click. All right. Now. Oh. Oh, how I hate these wrenches. <laughs> Get out of my hot bar. All right. Everything should be good there. Yes, indeed. Okay. What do we got? One full of air and 10 that are empty. <laughs> Why does that not surprise me? All right. So, once again, on to these guys goes uh, filters. Boom, 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 boom. And we want single item, single item, single item. Now, Connect them together. Connect them together. All right. Now it should be starting the process of transferring all of this stuff. Yeah. 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 Well, you don't have any yet. Why? Well, let's uh, get an iron ingot in to make sure everybody functions. Oops, won't take steel ingots. Why not? You can't make steel steel? Alright, you, uh... Just to get you started here. Alright, now... Oh, I need to be keeping empty one. Sorry, carry on. Okay. Let's try and get this bottom thing happening, shall we? So, what I want to do is simply get these guys into that chest so first thing we want to do is get this chest where it's going to be of some good to us believe it or not that's not down there all right This here, I want a chest right there. Where'd you go? There you are. Alright, Mr. Chest. No, don't put down another block of dirt, doughhead. Okay. So, simple, simple. First thing we want them to do is... That. Alright. Yeah, I know, I just piled all this dirt back under here. <laughs> of course I did. 
Okay, now there's our friend the chest, and there is our compressor. Perfect. So, what I want is, uh, we gotta come out the bottom, so... See, the one thing with these is sometimes the order is more important than one might imagine. Um, now, I need this guy, the grated hopper. there so I don't like that it feeds back in there maybe we'll have to do this the other way go with. See, I'm just worried the hopper will go straight into the back of this, and I don't want that. So, oops. You can see it's getting the uh, cans that we want. Oh, okay, that seemed to work. So, now we should be able to put, that is empty, yes, put this in here. That should tell it. Okay, it's got three empties. It's got no power. Okay, that's. Uh, <laughs> I said this is really, really getting uh, hard on the uh, resources here for fueling things up. So let's get some more power going on. Lovely. Okay, how are you guys doing? Unfortunately, you got a little bit cold, didn't you? You're not up to heat yet. All right. That's going to take a while. Um, it's definitely feeding the cans over. Unfortunately, then they're coming back here. They're not going into here. So, why? Pulling out of the bottom. Why is that in there? It's an empty fuel cell. Those are all empty. But it doesn't seem to want to take them up there, does it? Okay, so... Hmm. How about... we got to figure out how to do this in the opposite way. So... Um... that. It doesn't really seem to line up very well, does it? And then put those in there. Yeah, see. I'm pretty sure that chest already just took one of the wrong items, so. No, I don't see it in there. There's nothing in there. going here, but they're not going out. Alright. Um, hmm. See, that doesn't really want to connect, does it? Sure as heck doesn't look like it anyway. Um,
upgraded hopper. Okay, that's definitely connecting now. So if we put an empty fuel cell in there, what happens? Of course, nobody else has got fuel cells anymore. We actually need to uh, get some back into the cycle. But they are slowly starting to produce steel. down two. There's nothing in there. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, there they are. They keep coming in here. not getting sucked out of here. So See, they just don't connect right. Hmm. I don't understand it. I wonder if maybe I should just be using these uh, ducts instead. Let's try that. Uh, that might be better. Okay, well, I'm not getting anything in there. Still, though, that sure doesn't look very good, does it? Just doesn't look connected. Six. Oh, it's still using that up. Okay, it disappeared. It's not in there. You're still at six. Hmm. Well, let's watch this for a moment. Let's see what happens once it spits this out, if it ends up going back up at any point. Well, I suppose I should put the rest of them into the system. It's going to take a bit because uh, these have all got to fill. That one's now full. But this one's not. It's only got 3,000. And this one is not. It has none. We also need some iron. So this was something else I automated, and I'll show you that in a moment. This actually worked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, eh? All right, let's throw some iron in there. You still got some, but we'll be overly generous and give you some anyway. All right. Okay. Now... Ah, I see, that's just draining to keep that up. That was back up to nine, so it's working now. They're definitely going back in. But you're not getting any yet. Hmm. I 
it's just about empty. All right, I think we just need for this to all start to catch up a little bit, and then we should be good. But that should do it. I still don't like the look of that. I don't know what uh, what the deal is there. Oops. And, so and it would be some of these for that border. So yeah, that was the deal, is I just needed to use the right type of duct there. Um, now you are the wrong one. You should actually be this guy. Nice. And you... Or that one. I'll just look around back. Aha. There's the rest of the hideousness. So. Okay. That also is wrong, isn't it? That's not right. Behind there. Oh. It's not right at all. You should be one of those. It just looks funny around that thing, that's all. But this is actually the end of this one. So. Seven. Oh yeah, there we go. You're finally getting fed some air, are you? That's because now everybody else is eight. So yeah, this is nine. It's working properly now. Eight, yep. Yeah. Success, Aruni. Wow, that took a while. Now, I'll show you something else I've done in the way of yachtimation. Ooh, we got seven more steel. We're just rocking the steel, man. Look at that. We get to 19. <laughs> Another three quarters of a stack, and we'll be able to move on to the next stage. Okay. Um, all right, so that's good that that's automated. The other automation I did was this little thing here, this ejector upgrade, and then just a hopper duck and a chest to get it out. Now, ejector upgrades are pretty cool. Um, I completely the reason I wasn't going to bother with the automation is because I didn't want to get into pump or uh, pipes and blah 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 just for like I said when I can simply drop drag and drop one right beside the other however I was looking up something and noticed these funny little symbols so I had a look and thought oh yeah that probably requires you know nine diamondonium crystal things that are no a piston and some freaking tin plates. And basically this one, the ejector, it pushes an item out to the first valid side. So yeah, you simply stick it into the upgrade module of your macerator and it pushes it out to the first valid side, which happens to be a furnace, right? So now all I need to do is throw a duct, which I seem to be out of. Weirdly enough. Yeah, yeah. What do you know? Ha. Huh. But yeah. I can throw a duct on top of the macer the macerator, fill it up with huge, huge amounts of ore, and go mining or go whatever I want to do and come back and it'll all be funky. So there you are. We now have an automated steel production, at least as automated as I think these Looks like we've got enough cells to carry us for now. Okay, you haven't quite come up yet. In fact, I think I realized it was going to take a total of 24 cells. 
So we're going to need more of those aluminum cells before the day is out. I can see this. Or tin, I should say. Let's uh, see what this will get us to start with. Uh, is it all the way around? Nope, apparently not. Uh, bubba dubba dubba. There we go. So... Alright, and we got seven more. Nice. That's not a bad start. Oof. You can tell it's definitely recycling because this is always hanging around at eight or nine. So we've definitely got that underway, and I definitely got to stop saying definitely. <laughs> Alright, next up, well, I'm going to have to. Uh, woo -wee. We're getting low again. <laughs> Oh, I gotta find some way to make use of cre yeah, I'm almost out of coal. Gotta find a way to get creosol up. So far, um, it's not happening. So, I think that's probably going to do it for this one. We did, uh, well, we did dude what we needed to dude. And that, well, can I tell you, that's as good as it gets, quite frankly. <laughs> Alright, I don't want to carry that wrench around. I should probably eat a piece of that chicken. What have I got there? Stone. Stone is not something I don't think that I have a place for, actually. So, you... Dirt, I do. Sure. Stone. Oh, look at that. What do you know? And then that fancy piece of stone doesn't go there. It'll go over in the other one. There we go. Boom. All right. Ooh, I have more glass. Lucky me. <laughs> yeah, I found a spawner, eh? Ooh. All right, guys. That's going to do it for this episode. I got to go over and harvest some more crops. So. Till next time, this has been Species 7. Oh, one thing before I go. Um, it's come to my attention that I've actually got a couple of viewers who are not all that familiar with Minecraft that are actually watching this series and find it quite an interesting thing. Um, in fact, I had one person who didn't ever play it and decided to download the pack in Minecraft. They bought Minecraft. They downloaded the pack. And yeah. So, uh... <laughs> Wonderful. I don't think I've ever actually made anybody convince them to go out and buy a farm sim. <laughs> there you go, guys. Have yourselves a heck of a good day. I hope uh, the bit of information I gave you here today is of some value. Take care of each other. And ciao for now.